A lot. I think there's a little manny sign on you. Hey, Michael Jordan. How are you doing in there? Oh, yeah. You're about to hear my opinion on this Air Jordan 3 electric green. Because I've got some thoughts on it. What's up, Seed Squad? I'm Daddy Seed. And I'm Nadia Seed. Of normally, Dad and Son kicks it cooking, but today we have Nadia Seed, my baby girl. So this is a special edition. We'll call it Daddy and Daughter Kicks and Cooking. And, and, I'm like the special guest here, so. Hey, everyone. Just gonna say, hey. <laughs> Clearly she's shy, but Nadia- I'm shy? Yeah, I know, that was sarcasm. Nadia is a YouTuber in her own right. If you have kids, you have daughters, let them check out her her channel at- Nadia Seed. Nadia Seed, what do you talk about there? I talk about healthy lifestyle. In my lifestyle, I do crafting, I do miniatures, I do like workouts and drink healthy or yeah, eat healthy. All and that. All that stuff. All that stuff. That's right. Let your daughters check out Nadia's channel. It's amazing. Thank but you. the reason Nadia's here today is not because of her love for sneakers. Do you, you want to tell the people how much you love sneakers? Okay. So don't hate on me here now. Please don't. I'm not the biggest fan of sneakers. I've never really been interested in it. And I don't know why. Every time we go to a sneaker store, like in the mall or wherever, I always just get sort of bored. And it's just, sneakers seem just really boring to me. And you whine a lot. Do you want to tell them that part? You whine every time I say, let's go to the sneaker store. I'm like, Let's I look at some sneakers. Know. It's That's not, yeah, it's not my thing. But I think I'm about to change your mind, though. Hmm, we'll see. So the reason Nadia's here today on the Dad and Daughter Kicks and Cooking Show is because we are talking about the grade school Air Jordan 3 Electric Green that was purchased specifically for my baby girl. So these are Nadia's first pair of Air Jordans. They just released recently to the tune of 150 bucks, which literally is her most expensive pair of sneakers. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Did you just say this? This sneaker right here, this, these pair of sneakers yes. cost $150. I did say that, and you're 10, right? So yeah, when I was 10, I didn't get $150 pair of sneakers. My sneakers might have been 50 bucks. But it's a new day, and honestly, as we've been building this channel, Nigel's been getting shoes, I've been getting a lot of shoes in, Mommy's been getting shoes. Mommy's Yeah, I, I felt kind of bad. Nadia's kind of always seeing the boxes come into the door, and like, hey, is anything for me, anything for me? And I'm like, I gotta get her something nice, right? You gotta freshen you up. Thank you! And you have sneakers, you have Vans, you have Nikes, things like that, but. Um, just have one pair. Oh, uh, one pair right now. Because you yeah. keep growing, right? You're still in a growth phase. Right. So your shoe size changes every six months, eight months. But I saw these, I said, this is the one. We're gonna get out of your fresh pair. So yes. let's take these out the box. We're gonna look at them, we're gonna discuss them. And we also gonna get them on feet for Nadia. Yeah! <laughs> so you can check these out. On feet! I right. see nine of your videos. Those are so cool. That's it. You want to take them out the box and so take uh -huh. a look at them? Go Am ahead. I allowed to? Yeah. So how do I do this? This is my first time here. You pull them out. Okay. Let's <laughs> okay. start there. Like, Just take them out the box, buddy. Unless okay. you want to look at a black box. Yeah, show the people. Oh my gosh! Whoa, look at that. That is nice. What else is in the box besides the tissue paper? Wow. Uh, that's it. Just your typical Nike box. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah. And we've got the purple laces too. Oh, yeah, you can do oh, a little oh. lace swap action. You got that. So, the gray school electric green. You like this? I love this. This is so nice. It's kind of wow. reminds me of like the, the Joker color. There's an old Jordan. That's what I was going to say. Yeah? Yes, I was actually going to say that. I just didn't know if it was the right time because I feel like you usually get into your design later. That's okay. Just get into it. We're free flowing okay. today. This is not a big, super edited edition. We're just giving this straight from the cuff Nadia's instant reactions, her first time on the channel. Oh, so, with the shoe, Nadia. Yes. We've got kind of tumbled leather on top, right? I love this leather. Love this you. is some nice leather. It is nice leather. Smell, guys. Just, just smell. Just, just, just gonna smell all over it. They can't just, smell just, it. Just they smell can't it. smell it. They're looking at a, at a computer screen or a phone screen. It smells like rubber. But you got the electric green Jordan tongue, right? Woo! The black leather upper. Woo! You got your traditional elephant print, which is always on the Jordan 3, that crackle print around the edge. Oh, that's I like That's like it. elephant print. You know, if you look at elephant skin close up, that's kind of what it looks like. Mm -hmm. I like it. The Jumpman Air on the back. What? 
the Jumpman. This logo is called oh. Jumpman. It's Michael Jordan. It's a silhouette of him from way back in the day when the Jordan brand first came about. Cool. But it's called the Jumpman. Okay. Nice. I like it. And what I really like, I like the white midsole. Same. But then you got the. What's the white midsole? The white midsole is this part. Oh yeah, that's nice. <laughs> I like that. You see the air bubble? Air Jordans, right? Have an air unit in the that you can see. Oh oh that yes. Little window. Yes, I like that. The peekaboo window. The window. It's I actually this part of the oh cushion. Oh my gosh, I cannot really see through it, but I, oh, I can't see you, can you see? <laughs> Okay. Can you guys see me? Not really. Oh, okay. <laughs> Not really. And then you got the icy blue bottom that has a little multicolor on the paneling underneath. You like no. that? No. Look. You know how this shoe reminds you of a joker, right? You know some <laughs> elephants like are in the hot weather? Yes. Well. Most elephants are in hot weather. Yeah, most of them. Well, he switched to psychology. Mm. And then, now the elephants are in the cold weather. Ooh. And then this reminds you of the ice in the cold weather. Mm, the and ice. then, and then, and then, this shoe reminds you of the Joker. So the Joker rides the elephant in the cold weather. This is the story of the shoe. Boom, I think Nadia just gave them a whole new way to market this shoe. What about the electric green? Is there electricity somewhere? Um, No, that's just... An yeah. electrical storm, <laughs> lightning, I don't know. <laughs> Just coming up with something. <clears throat> but this is a shoe, again, I love this colorway. I thought this would be a good shoe. You could wear this with your school outfits. Ooh, you could rock it in kind yes. of really any weather. All right, so Nadi, we wanna hear your thoughts on this shoe. But you guys know what we do here at the channel, right? We're gonna take a pause, get in the kitchen, cook up something, see what we have that, you know, today's gonna be something special for my little special guest. She doesn't even know what we're doing. You gonna tell us about the shoe? Oh yeah, you're about to hear my opinion on this Air Jordan 3 electric ring. <laughs> Cause I got some thoughts on it. All right, so like I said, today we are doing something special from Baby Girl, who is our special guest attendee at the Dad and Daughter Kicks and Cooking Affair. Yay! So we are going to make a Funfetti Cake Cupcake. Cupcakes, we're going to make Funfetti Cupcakes and they're gonna be so cool. So I think we should go ahead, put these in these. We can start the baking and let's go. Yep, go ahead, put those in. I'll start looking at the box so we can figure out what we need to put in here first. The oven is already warming up to 350. Preheating. Yep, and we're gonna get started. Cause I'm down for some fun fetty. How about you? I am too. So I'm usually the cook of the house. Mommy Seed always does the baking. But we today, and Mommy Seed. True, you and Mommy Seed. My little shy little side apprentice over here. I'm not shy. I know. Like I said before, it's sarcasm. So we unbox the shoes. Now we're gonna unbox these fun fetty cupcakes. So we down. Who who doesn't love fun fetty? Um, actually, so I'm not the biggest fan of Funfetti. What? Um, I also don't really like any icing. The oh. only icing that I like is cream cheese icing, so this will be interesting. I do like cakes, but I don't like the cake icing, and some cakes I just can't because they're just, uh, but we'll see. Let me know out there if you guys have some of the pickiest kids you've ever seen in your life. No. Because I know I do. I'm not picky, though. I'm like the least pickiest. I'm just like, literally, I'm only picky with cake. That's like the only Don't really thing. like Funfetti, barely like cake, don't like icing. That's all a cake. I mean, yeah, but that's kind of the same thing. All right, let me get some eggs in here with this mix. You good coming along with the paper? Yep. All right, all right, three eggs. It's always a fun part, right, Nadia? Yeah. No! I wanted to grab the eggs! This is my favorite part of making a cake! Move out the way! <laughs> I'm here! Wrong! Hey, why are you trying to kill the eggs though? Yay. Okay, you did it. I don't want any shell in there now. Oh my goodness. I have to act like I. What are you doing? That's it. No, no, no. I have, to, I have to put the other eggs in. We're gonna eat this. Nobody Perfect. picks the eggs up after they've been in the cake mix, child. Oh. I do. Give me a cup of water when you're done, please. Oh boy. All right, here's what Daddy we're not gonna it. do. Here's what we're not gonna do in Daddy's kitchen. Make a mess. Let's this mix a, it. This is not extreme cake. Vegetable oil, Here, come on, Daddy. Put this in the trash, Get your please. hand in the game. Oh, this little younger, faster paced little Energizer Bunny. It's different than her brother. I'm not an Energizer Bunny, okay? No? No. You're hopping around. Here, can you wipe the outside? I can pour this in. Okay, pour, not dump. Here, Nadia, put this away for me. Thank you. Gotta keep her occupied for a second. Did you just put the oil on the floor, Nadia? Mm -hmm. That's not putting it away. Oh. Hey! Wait, now we'll start. No, Let don't me. worry. I got, I'm very careful with this, I promise you. No, no. 
Thank you, put it in. We're gonna just do medium speed, which is number two. You look like you've done this before, though. Make sure you keep it in the bowl. How about let me hold it and you you, you run it. No, no, we're not done. Five. All right. I'm so excited to taste this with my finger. It's not ready here yet. We're not at that point yet. Right? That's why I said I'm so excited to. Who possessed this little girl? Get your fingers out of there. Wrong thing. I will let me let me handle some of this. Where are you though? Get over here. Let's see. How much should we do? Like fill it, kinda. Uh oh. Now you're not even paying attention. I am. Where's my assistant, little baker? Here, now take this spatula. I just, I just want to look at these real quick. These what? These cones are just fun to look at. Let's just do this. Oh wait, no! Then you cook that the cone. goes after it goes. Hmm. This is so funny. Let's just do it like this. We can add some decoration, you know, like this. Save some batter for me, Daddy. See, because I'm, I'm gonna do some stuff with this cone. Okay, you trying to do something creative? Yeah. Okay, gotcha. <laughs> she is so creative, always doing something different. Thank you. Wait, I'm still working here. Are you? I think so. Okay, so I'm going to be putting these in the cones. Um, Daddy, see, can you please, since you're my sous chef, can you please show them the box of the cone? The box of the cone? Yep. The box of the cones? No. That. Oh. That's what I'm going to be making. Oh, this kind of thing here. Yes. That's and, pretty creative. Mm, thanks. And I'm going to be putting in three tablespoons of batter into the cone. All right. And the cones can just bake in the oven. Yep. Okay. Just stand up in a little cookie thing. I Let's mean, watch the cake. mess though, because I don't, you know, I'm all about a nice clean kitchen. Come on, Daddy. See, you sometimes you just gotta live a little, okay? Just live a little. You can live a little and be neat. See, watch me. Watch me take my time. See this? Then you come over here and you do this. It's the Daddy Seat approach. Did she really just walk away in the middle of my lesson? All right. All right, Daddy, back up. Peace. Excuse me? I just want to be extra safe because, you know, got to be safe in the kitchen. Let's not burn those little hands. Okay. Right. So we're going to put this one. Big one on the top shelf. Whoa. Careful. Got it. Let's not throw and it. Careful. Now that one has those cones, cones on so it. we got to be careful. Yeah. How are you going to stay standing up? All right, Nadia, can you put it sideways? Like, look. I have an idea. Let's just take these out. Then you're going to stick them in there once that's in the hot oven? Mm -hmm. Okay. Smart. That's usually your noggin. But put them towards the front. Turn. You can turn those. Yeah, that way. Perfect. And then put these cones. Let me get. Let me let me handle that part, please. This must be a daddy cone because this was really neat. Okay, seed squad. Since that is in the oven, I will see you later. And in the meantime, I will be giving Daddy Seed some lessons in the kitchen. I'm the chef, though. Not today. All right. Come with me, Daddy Seed. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, guys. Everything is happening right now. The alarm just went off, and then look what just happened. Ah, it's so crazy. It's out of control. Look what just happened. <gasps> oh, oh man. I know, right? It's the cones. They fell over. These beans are pretty yummy. Oh wow. These are so soft. They still need like some more time. You got cake drop down the bottom of the oven, though. Oh no. What are we gonna do? Oh, there it goes again. Too much. Too much. Go drum. All right, so these things are out of the oven. We had an accident with these cone situations you wanted to do, yeah. right? We had a disaster. I mean, look at this. This is so horrible. I don't even know if I can eat it. It's actually not that bad. I kind of just want to eat it by right now. I mean, you could. It's not too bad. It just spilled. It's like a double cupcake cone thing. Anyways, <laughs> let's ice what we have. We got icing in the bag. I cut the end of it so we could do a little piping thing, but I think it might have made it a little too big. Cause like I said, I'm not the baker of the house. I'm the cook, the chef. Yeah, but... so I'm like the baker here. So let me take over this, Daddy. Hold up. Can I just ice like maybe one cupcake? You want to do? It? Fine. Let's see how this works. Trust me. I'm just watching. Let me see. You see? You gotta learn from the master, okay? All right. All right. Watch this. Gonna come out heavy. Can get ice this one. Oh, that's a nice big chunky icing. Well, someone likes chunky icing. I don't. <laughs> oh, maybe this is too much, guys. What about if we do a little swirl. one of these buttons? Whoa. All oh, right. We could do that with our fingers, huh? How about we put a little on top? Echo. And then we. Uh uh. You don't like icing like that, right? I hate icing like that. But see, you watch Daddy Seed come in and fix it. They call me Daddy Seed Fix It. Hmm? Fix It Felix? 
Like, no, uh, Daddy Seed. What's that? No. What's that? Ralph. Like Ralph. Right, and Fix It Felix. That's me. Nah. Daddy Seed fixes it. Okay. All right, this is a project here. <laughs> Sorry, Nadia. I'm not the biggest bacon guy. I like to eat them, but I don't make them. Yeah. Here, Nadia, you okay. want to smooth some on? Sure, but Daddy Seed. What? Um, since I don't really like the icing, I'm just going to eat it like this, okay? The plain? Right? Sure. <laughs> Cupcake cone. It's so good. And the cone is literally soft. It's extremely soft. Mmm. I don't know how I feel about a soft cone. Mm. Mm. You like that? Okay. I'm just gonna stick with the regular style. You wanna look? Are you putting icing on there? I just wanna try it. You know? Okay. Oh, sorry. Take it right out my hand. All right. Well, this is it. Let me just get a taste of one of these cupcakes. Oh man. I forgot my sprinkles. Whoa. All right, we also have sprinkles. Let's not forget that. All right, here we go. A little funfetti with a little sprinkle action. Ta-da! We're gonna go with that. This is it for the Daddy Seed Kitchen. We got Little Minnie with mini cupcakes for my little cupcake. We saw some fun with her shoes. Now she likes her snacks. All right, we got these cupcakes done. Enough for right now. We got to get back to these shoes. If you like them, what we bring them with you today, give us a like and a subscribe. Helps our channel grow. We can keep bringing more content this way for you. Let me taste one of these cupcakes. Wow. Mm. It's a little well done around the edges. Oh boy. But the icing, I'm sure, is going to set it off. Mmm. <laughs> Good. Can't go wrong with the fun fetties, man. Y'all like fun fetties? Tell them your favorite cupcake flavor down in the comments below. How about that? Mine is carrot cake. Mmm. Red velvet? Cheers. Cheers. All right, so back here now, back to this shoe. Wrapping it up, Nadia. It's kind of light padding around the collar of the shoe. I guess that just makes it easy for you to run and run and recess on the playground and all that kind of stuff. That's great, because I love running. <laughs> Inside, the insole is just the Jordan jump man with a black insole. Pretty straightforward. Wait, um, what's an insole? It's where your foot sits inside. You see the oh, little jump okay. man inside oh, there? Oh, look, it's like a little man. Like a little man. I think there's a little man inside my shoe. What's his name? Michael Jordan. Hey, Michael Jordan. How are you doing in there? I'm doing good. Cool. C Squad, do you have little girls at home that maybe you cop this shoe for them, this upcoming drop that just happened? Got these on the sneakers app. You know, I thought it was a good call. Apparently it is. She's loving it. Um, Nadia, you got to tell us your opinion. What do you think of this shoe? Oh, hey. Squad. Well, let me tell you something. I really like how they really brought to the story of the Joker, the elephant, and the ice to life. I think it's really amazing how they brought it to life. You know, it's really great. And I really like it. I think you did that, though. That was your story. Oh. Well, anyways, I like how I did that. Okay. Awesome. I do, too. Love that. I really like everything about this shoe. The only oh, thing oh, oh. is that you see this electric green here. I like it, but it's just not my style, you know? I mean, I mean, I mean, I'm not the biggest fan of bright greens. Yeah. I know it's very specific, but I'm just not the biggest fan of bright greens. I do like how it blends with all the other colors. Colors nicely. Mm -hmm. Sure. I'm sure. It's just like a trim piece, right? Like it's, you know, an accent to the shoe. Because if not, then it's just black and gray. Like it's not a whole lot going on. If you cover up the green, that makes the shoe the electric green, though, really. Cool. But. Well, maybe, maybe then. Since I covered this part up, I do kind of like it. Maybe it's the purple that I'm not liking. But overall, I like how it's all working together, and that makes me love it. Um, out of a ten, I'll give it a eight point two five six. 256, not an 8.255 or 254, 256 is a very specific number. Overall, that's better than passing. That is a very high grade. It's not a nine, but that's fine. Your first pair of Jordans, loving that you love it. Guys, let me know if you if you did cop this for any kids in your life and your family. Even if you didn't, let me know your opinion on it. You know, it's the first grade school shoe we've done here on the channel. Should we do more? Should we up Nadia's collection going yes. forward? Let's do that. Oh, look, look who's liking sneakers now. Check it out oh my goodness what's happening do me a favor like and subscribe if you want to see more videos like this it helps our channel grow we'll see you next time thanks for hanging out peace Bye.